Welcome back in the corners to another video, and today's video is a face mask Friday video. So if you want to see what mask I use today and hear all the information, stay tuned. So me and Lori are going to be doing a peel off mask this week. That is a theme. And I'm doing one that I already had it open because I need to use it up. It's a big size, so that's one I picked. So it's from Freeman. It's the Cosmic Metallic Peel Off Mask. And I really love this one. It's a really good one. Um, it's very beautiful on the skin, like you can see. I did apply it off camera, so it'll give me more time to do the next part of the video. And I already used this before. So I won't be peeling it off with y'all, but if y'all do want to see a video of me peeling it off and all that stuff, I will link the videos down below when I did use it, just in case you do want to watch that. And you're only supposed to leave it on for 10 to 15 minutes or until dry. Um, I always wait until it dries anyways. And I really love this one. I will link it down below uh, just in case you want to get it for yourself. Freeman's a really good brand. I really recommend them. Um, they have really good items and they're affordable. Um, if this is on Amazon, I will put it in my storefront for y'all. If not, I'll link just the product. But if I do find it on Amazon, I do link the product itself for y'all so y'all can have it. So, I'll make sure to link Lori's channel down below just in case you want to see what mask she's using today for the peel-off mask. I should see what else she's doing today in her video and make sure you do go show her some love. So, while this mask is on, I'm going to be unboxing a giveaway win on one of them on Instagram. So, make sure you stay tuned for that. And if you are if you are enjoying the video so far or Face Mask Friday video, stay, uh, give it a thumbs up. It really does help out a lot. Um, so, please don't forget to do that. Also, um, leave in the comments if you use this mask before. Let me know your thoughts on it. So, let's get on with the unboxing. So, before I get on with the unboxing, sorry if you hear the cricket noises. My, if you don't know, my sister has um, a bearded dragon and a lizard. I can't remember what the, the lizard is, but she has a lizard and a bearded dragon. She has two of them. So, that's how, what they eat. So, sorry if you hear them. Um, sometimes they're loud and you can hear them on camera. So, I hope y'all don't mind that sound and it doesn't irritate you. But I got this box right here from Pop Beauty. I think that's the name of the brand. I always want to try this brand out. And was so excited when I won their giveaway. They said I won and I was so excited about it because I always wanted to try this brand. So I entered the giveaway. So this is the logo. And they did put a handwritten note, which I like. It says, hey, Chelsea, congrats on winning our poppin' giveaway. We're so happy to send over our light shadow palettes perfect for your inner artist thanks so much for your love and support can't wait to see what you what see how you make it pop xoxo the pop beauty team i love that it's handwritten and this is what it looks like inside so let's see if let me see what i got i will leave all the information down below of pop beauty's um information just in case you want to go to see check them out and see what they're um, makeup and all that stuff is all about. They sent me, wow, they sent me four palettes. And hopefully none of them broke because there is a little bit of eyeshadow in here. So fingers crossed that none of them broke and it was just from them shaking it. But hopefully they're not. So let's get on with what the palettes I got. So the four eyeshadow palettes we got is this orange and black one, which will be a great everyday palette. Orange and brown I meant not black brown one and this is um free fit as a shade of shadow name of this palette and I can't wait to try these out don't know if I'm going to use all of them because I do have a lot of palettes in my collection um but if not um I don't use them all I'm trying to get it open. There's a little piece of tape on this. I want to show y'all all the palettes. I should have opened it before it came away. I wanted y'all to see it being open. But, um, I saw some ladies try products from this brand. And it seems like a really good one. And I think I'm going to open it backwards. But I don't care if I'm messing the box up. Oh. Oh, no. I think this one's one that might have crushed. Uh, oh, it did. So I'm sad about that. Uh, I might have to let them know. I'll show you. I think it might be only one shade, but I'm so sad about it. I always wanted to try this brand. 
what I recommend for the brand next time, maybe put some bubble wrap in the packaging just so this doesn't happen, but I'll show y'all it. Oh, I'm so sad about that one. Let's see if the other ones are okay, but that's what I recommend to the brand if you do watch this, if you see it, and I'll contact the brand. I know this was a giveaway, but I'll let them know. Maybe they'll do something. I don't know if they will, but I'm sad about that. I always want to try this brand. Okay, let's see if the other ones are okay. If they're not, and they're all broken, I'll be so sad. So the next one is called Slay, and it's the purple one. Looks like this. And I put it back in the... I'm just going to lay them in the box, because I don't want shadow to get everywhere. This one I've been opening it from the top. Oh, can't believe that happened. But I'll let them know, maybe next time do bubble wraps to keep the palettes safe because they only put paper and that's all in the eyeshadow palettes so hopefully they'll do that next time because i don't want everybody's palette um to come broken so let me know down below um if you tried this brand before um and Please let me know if you ever got products that came like this or if this was just this one time thing that they, you know, didn't mean to send without bubble wrap. Okay, there we go. Oh no. I think they all came broken. I thought I would have like one good one. Oh no. That one's worse. And I did not like when I got the box, it was just sitting on my porch. I just set it on my vanity to get um filmed. And I'm so sad. And that looked like a beautiful palette. Okay, we got the pretty and pink one, which was one of the ones I wanted to try. Looks like this. Mm, I feel bad. I know this was supposed to be a good video to unbox a giveaway. And I was so grateful that I won the giveaway, but it came broken. Now, I think it's on their part because they didn't put a bubble wrap in their packaging. Like... That's why I recommend every time when I send out a, pa a palette, I always put it in bubble wrap, even though, you know, maybe the inside has bubble wrap in it, but I always wrap the product up in bubble wrap, keep it protected, and then I wrap it in tissue paper. Because I feel like during these times, sometimes the uh, male people are a little bit rough on packaging. So, um, you know, you want to be prepared for that because some people are rough with the packaging. And they don't know what's inside of it. They, you know, even if they put a fractal sticker, sometimes it still gets thrown around now and here and there. <sighs> okay, fingers crossed that pink one's okay. If they're all broken, I'm going to be sad because I really want to try out these palettes. But I'm not going to give them a bad review or anything on them. I'm just going to DM them and say that I think that y'all should be put up in bubble wrap and say that they all came broken. Because I just, you know, so they know. Maybe they're, I don't even know if they're a new brand or not. Okay. Oh, that one came broken too. <laughs> no. And they're all, like, shattered. Like, somebody sit on the packaging and shattered them. <laughs> oh, I'm so sad. Here's what that one looks like. Oh, and I got glitter all over me. So, we got one more left. Open. Oh, and I was going to do swatches of everything today in this video. But, that's not okay. So, the last one. Ow, that's a good enough. The last one to show is called Basic, and it's like the basic neutral palette you need. Um, 
Sarah, I want to be this to be a happy video, but it's not gonna be happy when all my giveaway prizes came broken. Like, oh no! Yep, that one came broken too, and I wasn't rough with it. No, I don't know. Yeah, that one was three shades. I'm so mad. We're not mad, just upset and sad. And I got glitter all over my hands now. And they were so sweet about the package, leaving a handwritten note. And I'll contact them and tell them about it. I know this was a giveaway win, but I just want them to know that the information. So, I'm so grateful I won, even though that came broken. So I'm just going to keep everything in the box, try to send pictures of everything. And hopefully, if y'all do check them out, they do better on their packaging. For you. I know some people, they chopped on Pop Beauty before. So that's my unboxing and my video for today. Sorry, it was a little sadding. Exciting, sad day. Um, but I'll link the information down below for Pop Beauty just in case you want to check them out and see if they do better on your packaging if you order online or not. And um, I will link the information about this mask down below as well. So I think that's it. Please give this video a thumbs up, it helps out a lot. If you enjoyed this video, please let me know. Um, give me like a little heart emoji to help me. Be happy that that giveaway did not come broken. Yeah, you know, but I'm okay. I just wish they, you know, did better on their packaging. So I think that's it. So that's it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. Comment down below if you enjoyed seeing me do this masking video slash unboxing of a giveaway one. Let me know your thoughts down below. If you tried the brand before, before Pop Beauty or Freeman, this mask before, let me know your thoughts. I'd love to know. And also, don't forget to check out Lori's channel and see what she's doing today and show her some love. I forgot to mention this is an open collab. Anyone can join in. You just have to put that hashtag in your title, which is hashtag Face Mask Friday. And tag me or Lori in your first video. Um, and lastly, don't forget to subscribe to our Unicorn family. Hit the bell icon to be notified when I upload. And unicorns, always be yourself. Bye.